The Crescent Cottages, Rohini. Do you know where the Do Re Mi Cottages in Rohini are? They are the row of cottages close to the village centre, down the hill where Rohini Dart Station is today. They are called Do Re Mi Cottages because there are eight cottages altogether, just as there are eight notes on the musical scale. Their other name is Crescent Cottages because they are built in a semicircle called a crescent. The Crescent Cottages are among the oldest buildings in Rohini. They were built around 1790 by Samuel Dick, the governor of the Bank of Ireland and a wealthy businessman. He lived on a large area of land in Rohini and built these eight houses for his workmen. Samuel Dick also built a school on Main Street beside the old graveyard of St. Assam's. It became known as Dick's Charity School because it was intended for poor children of all persuasions. This building, the oldest in Rohini, still stands today, but is now a restaurant. When Samuel Dick died in 1802, his will stated that the rents the tenants paid for the Crescent Cottages should be used for the salary of the schoolmaster of his charity school. Over time, the cottages fell into disrepair, and by 1879 were in such a poor state that Lord Ardalon, the owner of St Anne's estate, paid £375 to improve them all. In 1947, a terrible tragedy happened in one of the cottages. A gas leak killed Kathleen McKee, aged 11, and Hector McKee, aged 10. Luckily, the other six members of their family survived. The cottage closest to the station house pub was once the village post office. The cottages have remained almost unchanged since they were built in the 18th century and people still live in them today.